20 miles from Cal Poly's campus on the coast of the Pacific Ocean sits California's last nuclear energy source. The Diablo Canyon power plant creates enough energy to power over 3 million Californians' homes. In 2018, the state decided to decommission Diablo Canyon in order to slowly replace nuclear energy with other types of clean energy. So there's a few ways it could affect the community, and it won't be immediate. Um, Eventually, well, there's, there's a process. I mean, first you have the closure and the, de and the shutdown of the reactors. Then you have a long decommissioning period, which could be a decade or more. And then you have a period where the decommissioning is complete. However, last year, the California government voted to keep Diablo Canyon running, going back on its original plan to have Diablo Canyon decommissioned by 2025. Right now, because the future is still a little bit uncertain, pg and is doing both things. They're planning for decommissioning, which will happen eventually anyways, and also planning for a five-year extension. The decision to keep the power plant open was made because California needs the energy Diablo creates to support the number of people who live here. Diablo generates about 9% of the energy of the state. And that's the big question, is if Diablo closes, what will replace that? Um, and the answer has been, for the most part, people looking for ways to do so in a green and climate responsible manner. There is an expectation that by 2024, 2025, we would have these alternative energies ready to go. Now that we get a little bit closer to that time, we've made great strides, but maybe they haven't been fast enough. The power plant is a major part of the San Luis Obispo community because of the jobs it creates for SLO. Diablo currently employs about 1,300 workers. So that's quite an economic stimulus to this local community. We, you know, we own homes here. You know, we go out to dinner here um, and so forth. We're the second largest employer in San Luis Obispo County. Also, nuclear energy is cleaner energy than burning fossil fuels. During the summer, we had those heat waves. And in 2020, and you've got the flex alerts because you live here, you know, it's don't plug in your vehicles from four to nine. Um, don't do laundry four to nine, you know, because solar's coming off and there's not enough, you know, reliable resources on the grid. So nuclear is is safe, it's reliable, um, available all the time, 24 seven, uh, it's clean. Even with the benefits of nuclear energy, some believe Diablo Canyon is a safety risk to San Luis Obispo in California. We still don't have a solution for how to store the spent nuclear fuel, which is highly radioactive and highly toxic and has to be managed oh so carefully. The other issue that is unique to Diablo Canyon is its placement near the Hosgree Fault. And there have been additional faults discovered in the vicinity of Diablo Canyon. Diablo Canyon will continue to run until 2030, delaying the decommissioning process and giving the state time to develop more energy sources. For Mustang News, I'm Gabrielle Downey.